We continue to learn more about the pandemic's major impact on education. A new report shows a historic decline in math and reading scores for students all across the country. Experts say it could have significant consequences in the years to come. That's why News Channel 5's Amelia Young is covering this live from Metro headquarters this morning. So, uh, Amelia, let's look at Tennessee students. How did they measure up? Ben, we learned from this report that Tennessee fourth and eighth graders are sitting around the national average when it comes to the scores for reading in math. But experts are saying because these scores are so low, it's going to take years to get them back on track and up where they should be. Now, the math scores from the national assessment are the worst decline ever recorded. About 25% of fourth graders and 38% of eighth graders are performing performing below basic level, according to the nation's report card. Students who were already struggling in school showed the most dramatic drops. The federal government is pumping billions of dollars into school districts, requiring them to spend at least 20 percent on combating learning loss. State education leaders here say strong interventions are in place to combat that loss and that because those initiatives began earlier this year, they haven't been reflected in these national results just yet. Grade 8 mathematics we know is a critical point in students' uh, academic careers and this again should be an alarm to a sense in that uh, it indicates challenges that students have in accessing particularly higher level math skills before they get into high school. Other factors include teacher shortages and teacher burnout. Those are especially high in areas that are more rural or areas with uh, more families that have lower incomes. And